What do Kushner talks with Chimes and Bang mean for Trump? A company part owned by Donald Trump's son-in-law and now senior White House adviser, Jared Kushner, is reportedly negotiating a deal with a Chinese company to redevelop 666 Fifth Avenue in New York City. The 41-floor aging property, which occupies a full block that fronts Fifth Avenue between 52nd and 53rd Street, was purchased by Kushner Companies in 2006 for $1.8 billion. 1.5 billion pounds. At the time, it was the highest price paid for a single building in Manhattan. But does Chinese interest in the building, just a few blocks south of Trump Tower, raise questions over a potential conflict of interest with someone so personally and professionally close to the U.S. president? And would a possible sale to China's Anbang Insurance Group pose security risks? Deal or no deal? On Monday, Bloomberg reported that Anbang was planning a $4 billion. 3.3 billion pound investment deal with the owners of 666 Fifth Avenue. The agreement, the news agency reported, would make Gushner Companies, owned by Jared Gushner and his father Charles, more than 400 million dollars, 327 million pounds. The report says that some real estate experts consider the terms of such a transaction unusually favorable for the US company. On Tuesday, however, and Bang said that reports circulating of its investment in the Fifth Avenue property were not correct. There is no investment from Man Bang for this deal, the company wrote in a statement. Kushner Companies later confirmed that it is in active discussions over the building in Manhattan, but did not name Man Bang specifically. Nothing has been finalized, company spokesman James Yalls told Reuters news agency. What are the potential conflicts of interest? After Mr. Kushner was given a senior role inside the White House, his lawyer told The New York Times that he would recuse from particular matters that would have a direct and predictable effect on his remaining financial interests. As an owner of Kushner Companies, and with close ties to Mr. Trump, investment deals under negotiation between his company and firms such as Anbang do raise questions. Responding to these concerns, company spokesman Mr. Yalas said that Mr. Kushner sold his ownership stake in 666 Fifth Avenue to family members, meaning that any transaction would pose no conflict of interest with his role at the White House. Kushner Companies has taken significant steps to avoid potential conflicts and will continue to do so, Mr. Yalas said in a statement. What do we know about the Kushners? Jared Kushner, 36, is married to Mr. Trump's daughter, Ivka. In 2006, at just 25, the softly spoken millionaire bought the once venerable New York Observer newspaper. Although he shares with Mr. Trump a complete lack of political experience, last year he exerted a powerful influence over the Trump campaign, including digital strategy and top level hires, and carried that cloud into the White House. His father, Charles, founded Gushner Companies in 1985 and made his fortune as a New Jersey property mogul. A controversial figure, Kushner Sr. received a prison sentence in 2005 for tax evasion, illegal campaign contributions and witness tampering. At the time, he admitted setting up his own brother-in-law with a prostitute, secretly filming the liaison, and sending the tape to his sister in an effort to dissuade them from testifying against him. The man who prosecuted Charles Kushner was the former U.S. attorney for New Jersey and 2016 Republican presidential candidate Chris Christie. Jared Kushner is reported to have been involved in counseling Mr. Trump to choose Mike Pence as his running mate, over Mr. Christie. What do we know about Anbang? China's Anbang Insurance Group was founded in 2004. It is now one of the country's corporate goliaths with an increasingly large international portfolio and interests ranging from banking to traditional Chinese medicine. The firm first came to prominence in 2015 when it bought New York's landmark Waldorf Astoria Hotel for $1.95 billion, £1 $1.35 billion, pounds, then the biggest U.S. real estate deal by a Chinese buyer. Following the acquisition, then President Barack Obama refused to stay at the Waldorf Astoria during a U.N. General Assembly gathering, citing security concerns. And Bang has been making an aggressive push into the U.S. property market over the last few years but little is known about the company. In April 2016, the firm unexpectedly abandoned a $14 billion, 9.75 million pounds, takeover offer for Starwood Hotels, ending a three-week bidding war with Marriott. According to reports at the time, there were questions over its financing sources.
The company now claims to have total assets of more than 1.90 yuan, $300 billion, £240 billion. What are Ang Bang's political connections? Ang Bang chairman Wu Ziahui is considered one of the best politically connected men in China, having married the granddaughter of former leader, Deng Xiaoping. Mr. Wu, 49, is considered reclusive but